Okay, so I figured I'd do an update on the mango that I started from seed. And I just pretty much neglected the plant because I put it down here in this pot right here. And I left it there until I could find room to put it. And little did I know there was a tomato plant growing in there. Which I could rip the tomato plant out. It's one of those Everglade tomato plants and they grow like weeds. So you can see it's all over here. But being my tomatoes here didn't do so well this year, I figured just leave it. At least I have some kind of tomato. I can scavenger some of these little tomatoes off it and use that. So I left it. But the tomato plant grew in the same pot. You can see it's quite a big stem in there as my mango tree. But the weird thing is, is since that tomato plant has been growing in this pot with the mango... Uh, the mango has actually started doing better. It wasn't doing good for a while. It was showing me really bad signs like it was sick. Like it didn't want to really grow. The leaves were very narcotic like this. You can see there was all kinds of weird damage and weird stuff happening. Leaves were crinkling and stuff. And since that tomato plant has been growing in there, you can see it's putting out some pretty healthy leaves. So I was like, you know what? Leave it in there, you know? But it's kind of, this plant is kind of dwarfed as it is. It's not really growing. But I, just for the sake of having something to video during the winter time, I'll maybe bring this in. And we, we'll do some small updates on it or I'll show it off during the winter. But honestly, it, it up here this far north, it, growing one of these is really unproductive. It's just kind of a waste of time or a novelty or something. Because I'm never really going to get fruit out of this thing. This plant needs to get to the size of a regular tree in order for it to produce fruit. But, like I said, for the sake of, you know, having something to videotape during the winter and maybe do a small series with it, I'll let it grow in, indoors uh, during the winter time. And that way I have something to videotape because there's really not much to do in the winter time. And I don't really want to shut the channel down for the winter, so... At least I have this. I can view this thing and uh, give you small updates here and there. But, yeah, I figured I'd do a quick update on this. I don't know when you're going to see this video. You might not see it for a month or so. Right now, it's August 28th right now, and you're not probably going to see this for a month. So, But either way, you'll get to see it sooner or later. I'm just saving this to upload later on down during the slow months, you know, while I'm doing my reviews on my tomatoes and my peppers and so we'll save that for the slow months but that's about it that's the uh, regular mango update that i planted from seed there it is it's still growing you can see it's getting nice and healthy and maybe i'll repot it before i bring it in or something because it looks like a lot of that soil disappeared already because these plants consume the soil so i may repot it and bring it in and we'll see see how it does through the winter all right so that was your mango update I'll see you on the next one.